You lost your files, huh? So if you clicked on this video, it means that you f***ed up. But don't worry, stop punching the wall, stop screaming into pillows, stop crying, because we're gonna be fine. You're, you're gonna... You're gonna be just fine. This happens to the best of us, but there is a solution, and it's really quick, easy, and it's free. The first thing that you're gonna do is you're gonna follow the link in the description, and it's gonna take you to Photo Rec. You're gonna scroll down to Operating Systems, and you're gonna click Download Test Disk and Photo Rec. And the Beta Test Disk Recovery 7.1 is the one that you're gonna do, and you're gonna click uh, Free Download on the corner here. Now it's just gonna start downloading automatically. You can donate to them. He's pretty well off. I don't think he needs any more money. He's, he's the man, but if, you, if you're stoked about it, give him some money. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna open this folder that you just downloaded, and it's gonna come up as test disk. What you're gonna do is you're gonna open up that file and it's gonna have a lot of crap. The thing that you're gonna wanna click on is called photo rec, and you're gonna double click on that, and it's gonna say it's unidentified, so go up to your system preferences, because it is a third party and it's not entirely on Apple guidelines. So just go to your security and privacy and then it was blocked, just open it anyway and hit open. All right, so most of us, what we're gonna get is this window. And if you get a terminal window, you're good. You can skip this part, but most of us are gonna get this white little thing that's gonna say, there's no disk found. Um, use the root. So to enable the root user, you're gonna go over to system preferences, users and groups, and then you're gonna go to login options and make sure that you are unlocked here. Go to login options, hit join, and then open director utility. Unlock this to make some changes into your password. And then you're gonna go over here to edit and click enable root user. So now you're gonna enter a password for the root user, so just use any password that you'd like and press OK. Now, you've enabled the root user, but you need to access it now. Okay, so don't do this yet. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna log out. You're gonna see your user, a guest, and then you're gonna see other. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna type in root as the username, and you're gonna enter the password that you just set. And then that is gonna allow you to come into your computer as the root user and then you're gonna find this video again for the following instructions. Welcome back. So now that you're back, what you're gonna do is you're gonna re-download, or it might still be there, but just re-download um, Photo Recovery and then double click on Photo Rec again, and now you should get the terminal window. All right, and then I had a previous session, so I'm just gonna do no and get out of that. You won't be prompted with that window. So what it's gonna do is it's gonna prompt you with um, devices that are on this disk. So I've got all sorts of devices and I'm, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna recover from my memory card here. So I've got 6359, which is 64 gig. I'm gonna hit enter, enter, other, whole, and then I'm gonna set the location to my documents. And then I'm gonna put it to a folder that I've created called recoup directory one. And then I'm gonna hit C on my keyboard to start the process. So what it's doing now is it's recovering and it says estimated time to completion is gonna be about an hour and 16 minutes. So for the sake of this video, I'm gonna stop this and you can stop it by hitting S. Would you really like to quit? Why? Okay. So you're gonna get um, your files into this folder now and they're named all sorts of crazy. So you're gonna have to really go through and really figure out what's going on. Um, I've noticed that uh, when I shoot in RAW, the photos that I get back are SR2, which is a Sony something image, I don't even know, instead of um, RAW, but they still have about half the metadata where I've got 11.5 megabyte file sizes where there'd be 20 something before. So you're gonna lose a little bit of data, um, but your files are here and you have them again. And my files are recovered and this is from the previous recovery from August 9th that I did this. So that was the last time that I lost all my footage and yesterday was the last time that I lost all my footage again. So this is free. It's really easy to use. I know that the terminal window can be daunting and 
If you follow this tutorial step by step, you will definitely get your files back and you will be a very happy camper. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, leave a comment, and hit that subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.